Hi guys, this is Maurice Perry. I'm here in the new facility that we're going to be ready pretty soon next month. I'm here with uh, our friends from Choke Lab. Uh, pretty much what we're doing here, we're going to build up a facility that pretty much everyone can come and train. We're going to have uh, conditioning, we're going to have kickboxing with uh, my friend Harry Hooft, and of course we're going to have Jiu Jitsu with myself. We are gathering some people to help us, such as Gilbert Burns, his brother, uh, Ricardo Rezendi also. So, uh, and of course, we're gonna have uh, one, one time a uh, day, one hour, maybe two hours a day, we're gonna be training professional fighters here in the facility. So, it's gonna be something very interesting. Well, I've been working with uh, Jiu Jitsu and MMA for a while and um, I've seen different models and uh, they were successful, some, some of them were very successful, other not so much, but I think the, di the difference in this project here is that we're going we're gonna to focus more on the, the regular client, we're going to focus on the students, regular students, and of course everyone is going to be treated as equal and, and, and whenever we have a, a, a spare time, we're going to focus in to help MMA professional fighters. That's, I think, is the difference. I've seen a lot of people doing the, the, upper, the other way around. They, they were focused in MMA, professional MMA fighters, and whenever they, whenever they have time, they try to, to work with regular clients. Now, that's, we're going to do the opposite. I've been working and fighting for over, I don't know, over four years, my, almost my entire life. Um, I have different business ventures, but you know, fighting was always my passion. Um, when I retired 80 years ago, when I was 42, and I retired from, from professional fight, fighting, I was kind of, kind of a little bit disappointed uh, and, and, and sad because I couldn't realize that I could not go on and fight anymore at the same level with the other guys. So I, I, I took a setback and stayed, stayed kind of a way of fighting business. Uh, for a while, but always training, always having a good time, and um, you know, I decided to come back again and try to to build a new legacy on the sport. Yeah, we are also um, having the project of building a uh, jiu-jitsu academy in Miami, and, and in this project, we're gonna have just jiu-jitsu. Uh, it's gonna be a, a pure jiu-jitsu academy. So it's gonna be Marius Perry Jiu-Jitsu and uh, it's gonna be coming up pretty soon, maybe mid of August. Well, uh, I have a problem that can be a quality. I, 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 you know, I feel very comfortable teaching that pretty much everything, MMA, submission, Jiu-Jitsu, self-defense. But uh, <clears throat> at this point, I think we're gonna focus more in Jiu-Jitsu. But of course, what, what tells us what to do is the demand, right? So, but I'm really thinking about Jiu-Jitsu that Again, we're gonna have, for sure, we're gonna have self-defense, we're gonna have uh, no gi, and, uh, but we're gonna be focusing to develop uh, a new gym in just in Jiu-Jitsu. Yeah, I think it's what's happening now is because we are having, you know, fighting, fighting business is growing so much, and a lot of people are having access to, to facilities that they sell fighting, uh, so a lot of people have the opportunity to learn how to fight and I truly believe and I've been doing seminars uh, for over a decade in America last year I did a lot of seminars in America and I'm still doing a lot of seminars and what I've seen I've seen a lot of people really worry about just about technique and they're forgetting the essence of Jiu Jitsu the essence of the martial art that is respect discipline and partnership and, 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 and things like that they're gonna help you to build better human beings. That's, they're, they're, they're losing in some way the really, the really 
point of the martial art, the, the really essence of the martial art. That's, in, that, that's something that I, I would try to bring it back in my gym. Uh, we're not just worried about we make great talents, great, great warriors. I think that it's easy to make great fighters. I, I, I helped a lot of great fighters in my, my life and uh, I'm very proud of it. Uh, but I think before making great fighters, I, I, help, I help them to become better human beings. That's what I'm looking for. We just built a website, myrisperry.com, and, and still under construction, but whenever you want to have some news, some updates, information about the gyms, just let us know and go there. And, and you can follow me also on Instagram, Maris Perry, and, and Facebook. And, and the website is looking really cool. I, I would have to, to thank so many people uh, in, in this path. Uh, you know, a lot of people helped me. Carson Gracie, my partner in Brazil, Walter Matos, uh, my family. And show glad to be here. Thank you very much.